Today I'm gonna give you a race recap of a race that is going on in the Philippines, the Ronda Pilipinas 2020. It is on its 10th edition and it's happening right now. The videos and the photos you'll be seeing in this video are courtesy of the Ronda Pilipinas Facebook page and the ever so charming, very very talented Mr. Snow Badua live streaming on their Facebook page abroad. They also make recap highlights of the race and air it on PTV channel at around Monday to Friday 5.15 to 5.30 p.m. and Saturday and Sunday 4.15 to 4.30 p.m. And here we go with stage one highlights brought to you by Snow Badwa Livestream on the Facebook page. Let's watch it, ladies and gentlemen. Ito na, mga kaibigan, pinapalipat na tayo ni Mikiram sa tabi. Ito na, wala na pong isang kilometer to the finish line. 500 meters to the finish line. Pakiramdaman, John Mark Galedo, inaamoy po ang kanyang likuran. John Mark Galedo, kumanan, bumalik sa kanan. George Oconer, inaamoy, dikit ka, dikit ka. John Mark Galedo, sumisipa na si John Mark Galedo. Aabot na po ang kanyang kikig. Now, gaining some watch is John Mark Galeto. Nakatutok. Ito po si uh, George O'Connor. George O'Connor, nakatutok pa rin. Nasa may pata kaliwa. Dikit ka pre! George O'Connor, John Mark Galeto. George O'Connor, John Mark Galeto. Who will win? Stage number one. Diretso ka. Nasa kanan. Naligaw po yung mga siglista natin. Patawa na naman mga kaibigan ng George O'Connor. George O'Connor and Mark Julius Bordeos. Ladies and gentlemen, Mark Julius Bordeos of Philippine Army will take win uh, number one for him. At Ronda Pilipinas, Mark Julius Bordeos. Here we go with stage 2. If you thought stage 1 was very thrilling finale, here's stage 2, a bunch finish. Let's watch it, ladies and gentlemen. Alright, ito na parating na bunch finish ka po! Isang buong grupo po ang paparating! Nakikita ko pula po ang harapan, mukhang 7-11! Tignan po natin, kikilalanin na lang natin sa kanilang mga mukha. Ayan na! Attacking at about 52 kilometers per hour. Puro Navy na po kayo! Navy na nasa harap! Puro Navy po ayan! Navy humahatong ang Gopher Gold! Pero mukha Navy! Navy rumaratras po! Navy against Gopher Gold! Navy against Gopher Gold! Navy against Gopher Gold! And it looks like Ryan number 61! Ryan number 61! Ryan to Gawin will walk away with the stage 1 victory that's still unofficial! Wow! That was one of the most intense finishes that I saw in my life. Whoa! The Raiders came to the finish line at a blazing speed of 61 kilometers per hour. So here we go with stage 3 winner Jerry Aquino Jr. Let's watch how he did it on the final 50 meters of the race or 100 meters of the race according to Snow Badwa. Let's watch it. Alright, here we go. Inalapit mo natin sa finish line. Ito na! About 50 meters to the finish line! Or make that 100 meters to the finish line! Philippine Navy po! Mga nasa harapan! Navy yung mga ataw! Pero po mapalag po ang pagkataka 7-11 na sa may patalikuran! May kumakala po! Mula dito sa Gopher Gold! Bukang taka Gopher Gold po! And bukang ito po! Right there! Scratch it! Ladies and gentlemen! Ang malalalo ay Jerry Aquino Jr. So Jerry Aquino Jr. Winning stage number 3! Dumakaw po sa may bandang kanan! Ito po ha, si Jerry Aquino Jr. or kaliwa po ng mga siklista. Isang dukot sa kanan ang ginawa ni Jerry Aquino Jr. para po manalo para sa scratch at Jerry Aquino Jr. Stage 4 was a different story though. It says winning with a statement. These big boys of Philippine Navy Standard Insurance took it. 1, 2, 3. With a win given to Mr. Ronald Lumotos and Junre Nabara and El Joshua Carino. If you want to watch the full video of Stage 4 Snow Badua live stream, I'll give you a link on top. And if you really want to watch a live stream on Facebook, don't forget to give them a like. It's Ronda Pilipinas. And you will see lots and lots of live stream from Snow Badua and DJ. Bobby Otulio. Let's get into it. Stage 4. Para pumoporma sa may kanan. Diyan para. Kukunin na niya. Diyan na yung nabara. Ayan na. Pero Ronald Lumotos tumatayo-tayo pa si Ronald Lumotos. Tignan natin kung kanina po ang DC. Ronald Lumotos nagtaas na kamay at pinapakita. Navy at dirito pa rin kami. Ronald Lumotos crossing first. Diyan na yung nabara second. And El Joshua Carillo 
dancing in victory and in jubilation. Ronald Lubotos finishing first, Junre Navarra second. Whoa, perfect finish para po sa Philippine Navy. Now, they don't have to prove anything. Stage 5 was something incredibly crazy that happened in the history of Philippine cycling. Philippine racing cycling. A whole team went on a breakaway and took the peloton on their neck. <laughs> I was having goosebumps watching the live stream of Snow Badwa and Ronda Pilipinas today. It was just crazy. It's like Philippine Navy standard insurance versus the peloton. Watch the details over here. Go. Martin. Final 350 meters to the finish line. Kumusta po kayo? Kumusta po ang inyong pananood? Nag-enjoy po ba kayo? 250 meters to the finish line. Nagtataas ng kamay. Ito po nga si Ronald Lumotos. Kumakaway sa kanila mga fans. Here we go. We can see the finish line. 150 kilometers. Nakataas ang kamay. Ni Ronald Oranza. At saka rito po si John Mark Camingaw. Nagkakaway-kaway ang mga siklista. Mga riders from Philippine Navy. They are truly dominant. And they totally dominated in the book stage number five to the warm applause of the fans in the book the finish line what a finish ronda Filipinas 2020 consists of 11 teams let's start with the first team the team click 711 road bike philippines second team is the gopher gold continental team third team is the team scratch it Fourth team is Team Bike Extreme. Fourth team is the Team South Luzon, Batangas. Philippine Army Team. Team Nueva Ecija. And Philippine Navy Standard Insurance. Team Tarlac Central Luzon. Celeste Cycles PH Double Project. As but not the least, close to my heart, Team Ilocosur! By the way, Mr. Erlanger Orsino, or Earl Orsino for short, is a close friend of mine. I met up with him in Ilocos in Lawag and gave him a Brighton Rider 100, a GPS device to record your cycling training. I know this kid has a future and he will do good in the next remaining stages. Good luck to him and you can follow him on Strava Earl Orsino, E-R-L Orsino. He also has a YouTube channel, Earl's Works TV. Go subscribe to his channel, okay? I hope you like this recap of the stage 1 to 5 and I'll be doing stage 6 to 10 after the race is done. And please don't forget to give this video a thumbs up, give it a like, and don't forget to subscribe to my channel and share this video to your friends. Thank you! And I'd like to give a big shout out to Ronda Pilipinas for doing a great job and making the race so beautiful. I've never enjoyed such a race in a long time. And I'd like to give a big shout out to Mr. Snow Badwa and DJ Bobby Odulio for keeping the live stream very, very thrilling and exciting. Don't forget to like their page, Ronda Pilipinas Facebook page. Give them a like. Alright, bye bye. See you next time.